moved from a matted row, that was the system my father used, to a plastic ultra system. So we had more uh, acres of, of strawberries and uh, uh, we started in 2006 the raspberry in tunnels and we had uh, we, we built new uh, larger larger greenhouses. Today we we, uh, we grow 34 hectares of uh, strawberries, uh, 2.8 in uh, raspberry, and uh, we have 6.5 hectare of uh, greenhouse tomatoes, ma mainly tomatoes, some um, uh, peppers, orange, red, and yellow peppers, um, and also uh, some uh, cucumbers. I can just tell you that here. Uh, in Quebec, we are sure uh, of two months that we have uh, no frost. So July and August, we're, we're mm -hmm. sure that there's no frost. We can have frost in, in June and also in September. So we have a pretty short season. So there's a strawberry schedule. So we use the short day and day neutral plants. Um, fresh fresh blogs and dormant bare root. Uh, the, the fresh blogs are mainly um, uh, clary, planted in August, mid-August to end of August. Then um, uh, we also use the dormant bare root frigo plants, varieties like Wendy Stella, Joel Sonata, um, Malwina. Uh, record and Valley Sunset, uh, we don't we don't grow them anymore. Um, so planting date is June, uh, beginning of June, and we uh, harvest um, um, mid July to uh, beginning of August, the first year. Yield is pretty low, but at that time um, there's not a lot of uh, strawberries on the market, so price is uh, very good at that time. So these plants will fruit also the second year, and uh, it's going to be between uh, end of June to uh, beginning of August.